Hi guys, this is Cobra Tom. And Brown Lily. And this week's video is going to be about slime bash. And this is our custom slime that we made this week. We went to, uh, well, it was in St. Charles, but it was the 2019 Slime Bash in Chicago. And we had tons of fun. And we have a short, short video we'll put up sometime with this and uh, show you how we were kind of just making this. It isn't very long, but... Uh, it was really loud there, though. It was really loud. But we had a lot of fun, and we're going to show you our custom slimes. I'm just going to point this out. Um, to get slime out of the container, just pull it. Yep. And then you spill beads all over the floor again. Yes. Okay, so mine, my slime that I made is called Ocean Life. I, I named it that because it was blue. That's my favorite color, so. Yep. And it came with a container. Well, uh, Dad had to buy me a container for it, but it was fine. And I put the beads that I'm going to put in there. I have lots of different colors. And I actually spilled the beads on the floor, so we're just going to put all those beads back. How did this happen? There. Look at that. Eh. There we go. Okay. My slime isn't too sticky. Like, it's not overly sticky like some of the ones. But it's sort of sticky. Like, in a good way. I don't know if it can be sticky in a good way. But... In a good way. We'll leave it at that. Because if you're going to add beads to slime, you have to have it a little sticky at least. We'll sprinkle some on on the top. Oh, I missed terribly on that one. So it kind of looks like ice cream right now. These are not micro beads. Because if they were micro beads, they would be so small and it would turn into this really big flown. And it would expand really big. But I'm just gonna do this. And that's just product right now. Oh, I failed. Oh, I'm a failure. Oops. Oops. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, goodness. Why are the beads, like, deactivating my slime? So weird. It kind of looks like a wave now. Okay, let's do this one more time. Why I chose the name for my slime is because I was thinking, okay, is blue, what goes with blue? And I was thinking, ocean, ocean, yeah. And so I picked ocean, and now it kind of looks like a wave, see? Wave. It's a really bad impression of a wave. Oh, and I also chose a scent for mine. I can't have you guys smell it, but I wish I could. Um, it's a Captain Crunch smell. Oh, that's right, yep. And I have beads all over the floor right by me. Yeah, well, that's all right. But the best part about doing this is you fill a container with beads, and then you just do this. Yep, and then it fills up your, you can fill up your own 
And as many beads as you want. Your own sign, but as many beads as you'd like. Yeah. Oh, that, that, that is... Oof. <laughs> a, a little clumpy in one spot? <laughs> yeah. People with trypophobia would not like to watch this. Because of the beads and the clumpiness and the bubbliness and the... Yeah. What is that? Trypophobia? Fear of holes. And feel of like, like when sometimes they look at this, they'll get scared. Like, my sister can't look at pomegranates. Interesting. We can maybe insert a picture in a minute. Okay, <laughs> yes, we'll, we'll have to find a thing and insert a picture. But one of the more disgusting ones, because we like to do that to you guys. Yes. Okay. And since you spilled some on the carpet, I'll clean up as much as I can. Give you a few more. It's fine. No, uh, if we put any uh, much more in it, the, it won't fit, fit into the container. So I think this should be good. Once I put the rest of these. I made it look like ice cream a little bit ago. Oh, good. Okay, I want to make this look cool. I don't know if that was cool or if that was just weird. Looks cool. That looks... Interesting. Interesting! <laughs> Definitely interesting. Yeah. Oh, sadly, um, Karina Garcia was not at Slime Bash this year. She was last year, I think. Uh, yeah, she wasn't there. We met a few of them. But Parakeet though. Slimes was, if you guys know. And she... Nicole Jacqueline? Oh, yeah, Nicole Jacqueline. And somebody else, but I, didn't rec I can't remember what the name was. We'll now. have all their pictures in a row in a minute. Yeah, we'll put up... Some pictures in a minute here. Okay, well this is Ocean Life, and we'll see you when the next slime appears. This is me with Nicole Jackson, Jackson at Slime Bash. So, yeah, um, we just took the picture because I, I asked her if I could have a picture with her, and she's like, sure. So um, I take a picture with her, and I was like, thank you, and yeah. I knew that her slides were gonna be really expensive, so I left her booth alone, but I mean, I, I got a picture with her, so yeah. Here is um, Nicole Jackson as a like animated thing. It's not, it's kind of like her logo, but it's not exactly her logo, but it's somewhat Nicole Jackson. So here's Parakeet Slime. I did not meet her because she is in the VIP section, but I got to, I got to see her from a distance, but. We, we went into the uh, VIP section. Oh, they didn't have sorry. anybody uh, kind of looking at anybody's wristbands. So we were kind of in a place that we shouldn't have been for a little while. Yeah, but here's Parakeet Slimes, and next is a picture of Trypophobia. So if you want to skip to later in the video, just like 30 seconds later, we'll... Yeah. yeah. So this is a picture of Trypophobia, as I was saying. And um, it to me, it's kind of disgusting. But like only when, if you look it up, there is makeup artists, makeup artists, it's not real, I promise, that can make fake holes in their hand. Oh. Yeah, that's kind of scary. And then they put a fake worm in there and it looks, ugh, disgusting. Okay, I have to change it now. Just before we move to the next slime, I wanted to show you what the scent bottles look like. This is my Captain Crunch scent. Yeah. 
and that went in my blue ocean, which makes no sense to have ocean life in Captain Crunch. Well, this is my slime. Technically, um, I helped her make it, and she said to me, well, why, why don't you get another cup? And other cups were like $2 or something like that. And since G.I. Joe is my favorite thing, and since Big Boa is my favorite character in G.I. Joe, I decided to name my slime Big Boa Orange. And he is just kind of in there. He's not really like... Well, he is kind of <laughs> got a little slime in there on him. Not too, too terribly bad. A little bit yet. So, but this is the slime that I bought. And this is the scent that I bought. Mine is Lava Colida. I hope I'm saying that right. If I'm not, then I feel silly, but that's okay. It's not the first time I've felt silly before. And this is the Lava Colada, and it smells really good. And I just, it's kind of got a lemony kind of sort of scent. And I picked it, and I thought it was really cool. And she made a comment before that her Ocean Slime and Captain Crunch don't go together, which is... It, it doesn't because it's a cereal, but he is a captain and he does have a boat, so it would kind of go. Can I fix this a little bit? Yep, and one of the other accessories, when we were leaving, we were just, well, we saw it earlier and we decided that these little pigs are just super cute and I really liked them and she really wanted them and I at first said, well, let's just, Let's just wait till the end. Just make sure we have enough money. They were only $5. But we had other slimes and scents and other... Things we wanted to buy Other first. things we wanted to buy first. So we decided, let's just wait. And we thought, if there's time and if there's money, we'll, we'll buy these. And we're just going to buy them for fun until we made the orange slime. That's right. And then we decided that these little pigs... Are gonna look so great with the, with that slime, and look at him. He, he's, a, he's a little baby pig farmer. He's so cute. He's a little piggy. I'm just oh oh oh. Do you want to see all of his pigs? We got 25 in a bag. And I have I actually have some in a different slime. <laughs> yeah, we put it in a see. different. Yeah, and then we put it a few of them. And they were they were in a. Well, not a huge bag, but they were in a good size bag. And when we were looking at them, we weren't even sure how many there were because we were just kind of looking at bags, trying to figure out which one maybe had the most in it. And we found out that it's got a 25 count. That was a lot of, that's a lot of little piggies. So maybe that, maybe the rest can go on my birthday cake or something someday. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, it matches so nicely with that. This is his little pig farm, by the way. Yep, he's a little pig farmer. Um. Anyways, the actually the this doesn't only just smell lemony. It smells. Oops. Like you just knocked over Big Boa. It smells like a hair salon. Ah, it, I like Fantastic Sam's. Yeah, it smells. It smells pretty good. I like it. So, that was my slime. I didn't play with it. Or put the pigs in it. Or put the pigs in it. Well, you okay. may do that. Here, I don't give me mind. Big Boa. Here's Big Boa. But you will see the end result in a second. So this is my, well, Dad's slime, but the presentation that I am really good at decorating because this is so funny. Yeah, and here Big Boa is. He's petting his little pig and showing his little piggy that he's in love with him. Mm hmm Oh, and now it's time to take Bo Big Bo out and mix these little piggies in. Let's mix the piggies in and take... Wait, I have an idea. Ready? Ready? Big Bo out. Oops, I missed. <laughs> One orange dot. 
and one last big bowl. <laughs> oh no. What? I'll get that out. You just need a toothpick. There we go. That sort of worked. I'm only going to put three pigs in the slime because I don't want them falling out. So. Alright, you meet it up. With the one bead. Yeah, there we go. Scoosh. Scoosh. Oh, look at him sticking his little head out. Never to be seen the third one again. <laughs> Pigs are her favorite animals, so that's why we. Well, not the only reason, but another one of the reasons why. Oh, there. He's, he's stretching with the slime. See him? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Another that one. Wait, the weirdest sound ever. I'm yeah. going to re. Do that. Oh, two pigs came this time to join the party. <laughs> that was cool. That one looked good on that on, on camera. Let me tell you, your daughter knows how to play a slime. That's right. Let's see how many, if I stretch, how many I catch this time. Oh, I only caught one. See, when you watch them drop, you'll see them right here. Doop, doop, doop. Oh, uh, yeah. Doop. I'm gonna try to get a bubble. Oh, there's a nice big one. So, when we first got these slimes, it was intended to be a butter swirl. A butter is, um, because most of you are G.I. Joe fans and not really slime fans, you can skip these videos or watch them, blah, blah, blah. But we would prefer if you watch them. But a butter slime is when you take um, clay or model magic, a uh, soft sort of thing, and you put it in with slime, and it makes it like a really smooth texture. But it's supposed to be a butter swirl, so we were at first planning on two swirlies, and I got my favorite color, which is either teal or blue, and they had teal, so I took teal, and Dad took orange, because that's his third favorite color, because they didn't have black, and then they didn't have red. Yeah, they didn't have just a regular red. So then I just picked orange. I like orange. So, the butter swirl. Yeah, we were supposed to swirl them. Then I loved this slime too much. So I said, I'm not swirling it. And as we were reading the directions, we are reading the directions. And, we're, and it's for a totally different kind. I think it was for the snowflake kind. It was the marshmallow fluff. Oh, marshmallow fluff, yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's why I was taking so long. Yeah, kind of use the wrong kind of instructions. But. but really, to make slime, it's the same thing. But then you just add diso clay to these and then the other ones. See how it's just so smooth in the texture? And then in the next video, other slimes will be like a different texture. That's right. We call this kind of slime a crunchy. Put a bunch of stuff in it, too. That helps it. Kind of give it a texture. Not going to keep him in there, but... And there's a piggy. Bee! Well, this is our video. We had a lot of fun doing this. We had a lot of fun going to Slime Bash. We'll have other videos of this and other pictures. And if you go to our Facebook page, you can see a bunch of our pictures are up there. Oops. But uh, we're going to do a few more of these this month and maybe do some Joe stuff with it. So thank you for watching and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Da, 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 da. It's no longer nice and stable or oh. smooth. Oh, oh well. Wait. Thank you for watching and we will see you next time. Bye. Wait, Bye. wait, 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 wait. Oh, there's a piggy. The piggy. Oh, he came out nice. Oh, I accidentally got blue. Eh, it oh, blue. no, the horror. We got so much blue and orange mixed up at that place. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't matter anymore. Nope. Bye. Oh. Bye.